This is a quick second video for your question on the floor of the 2004 Palomino. So uh, what we have here is a pretty large floor. Um, the entranceway is firm. I personally would not try to do a repair to this floor at this time. Uh, you got a little softness right here from the edge uh, right down and also the edge of the shower. Okay, um, I mean, obviously it's pretty cold here right now, but I'm 240 pounds and it's not even barely giving when I step on it. However, I do note that it is soft. Now over here on the other end, right under where the sink is, we have another area right here in this corner of softness. And you can see there's a little rippling of the, of the linoleum. Um, but again, I really wouldn't bother to repair this at this time. I would just, uh, you know, be aware that that is, uh, it is soft, but it's not to the point where it would be worth your time to tear everything out and, and replace that. As far as the, the leaks go, um, I'm pretty sure that the leak on this end was from when the top was down and it leaked right here at the corner when the top was down. Your, your question was, is it sealed up now? Um, we did not do any sealing to it. However, it appears to me that the previous owner did. And here is the, the edge of it. And you can see that there's, there's new sealant that's been put on it. Now, some needs to be put right there, but there's definitely some that has been applied to this corner in the last couple of years. Um, as with any used RV, I always recommend that you do your annual maintenance to it, uh, as you should with any RV. Be checking at minimum three times a year uh, for any leaks. This Mustang does have the, um, the one-piece uh, roof across the top, so there's no center seam on this one, only seams on the edges, which makes it a lot easier to, uh, to maintain. If you have any other questions, uh, my cell phone number, 240-405-7790. Feel free to give me a call anytime. Thanks.